Cobb County State Representative is in hot water tonight after he was arrested overnight here in Atlanta. Devin Siva was jailed overnight on DUI charges after troopers determined he was driving while intoxicated after hitting a bicyclist. 11 Live's Doug Richards is live in Grant Park where this all took place. Doug? Yeah, this collision happened uh, in a bike lane adjacent to Oakland Cemetery. The bike lane is here. It wasn't here a few months ago. And you can see that it's still a work in progress. It's still under construction. There is paint that is still to be uh, completed in the bike lane. And so this is where uh, police say that the state representative and the bicyclist collided. The bike lane is in use, but still a work in progress both as a construction site and as a new fixture on a busy road, observed by a resident who asked us not to identify her. We really love the new bike lane, but one of our favorite new pastimes is to sit on our porch and watch all the cars mistakenly turn into the bike lane and wonder how to get out. She says for weeks the bike lane had been poorly marked and easy to misjudge by automobile drivers who'd enter the bike lane as if it was just another lane of traffic. We witnessed the incident last night. A bystander with a camera documented it when state troopers arrested Republican State Representative Devin Sebaugh. The state patrol says Sebaugh was behind the wheel of his Cadillac Thursday when the SUV collided with a bicyclist in the bike lane. The state patrol hasn't said how the cyclist is doing. Sebaugh was charged with DUI and failure to obey traffic control devices and jailed. In a statement, Sebaugh said, I'm thankful that no one was hurt in Thursday night's traffic accident. I appreciate the professionalism of the law enforcement officers on the scene. I look forward to the facts coming out and providing clarity to all concerned. All right, Doug, so is Siva on the ballot in November? Some of his constituents might be wondering about that. Yes, he uh, actually won the primary unopposed, the Republican primary. He is facing a Democratic challenger named uh, Carl Gallegos in a district that leans Republican, uh, but had a lot of Democratic votes in the primary. All right. We'll keep an eye on that one as well, Doug. Thank you so much.